Hello everybody and welcome to Minecraft Modded Survival Season 2! That was fun. Um, I'm kind of hoping this one goes a lot better than it did last time because if you remember there was quite a bit of rage right there at the end. And break this. I thought I was doing good. I may have to go in there with a pumpkin on my head. That is severely going to limit my vision, though. I didn't forget my telepad. You guys blew it up. Don't suffocate, don't... What the heck? Yeah, okay, I, I'm out. Well, I'm getting some apples to start with, getting some wood. I've kind of taken a little bit of a look around just to make sure that I didn't start on the island of hate again. And that is what I'm going to constantly refer to that as, because I did not have it anything to help but as you can see I've got cows I've got trees if I jump up over here it goes on for a while there are some sheep I'm not gonna have to kill spiders to get all the wool I need to make it a bed for the respawn so all in all this one is already starting off a lot better than we had last time nothing there as far as the mods I have installed, I will link those in a list down below in the description. But yeah, let's play some Minecraft. Let's see what happens. Hopefully I don't just get completely and horribly enraged again. Um, as far as a brief look at some of the things I've got... I've installed something called the Emeralds tool, so I'll be able to make emerald stuff, and there's an actual emerald dimension as well. Um, the overall goal that I was thinking here was dimensions. How many other worlds can we go visit? So I've got uh, Twilight Forest installed in this one. There it is, Twilight Forest. I've got Applied Energistics again, which we didn't really touch on that much last time. Uh, Buildcraft, that's in here. I've still got the, uh, what are they called? E-N-D-E-R, yeah, the Ender Chest stuff. That's in here this time, so I can move things around pretty easily. All in all, I think a better setup, I think, what is that? I'm not used to seeing blue. What is blue? Because that doesn't look, oh, it's water. I didn't think it looked like water. That is a big tree to start us, or a big hill to start us off with. Uh, what am I in at the moment? I'm in plains. Does that mean this is an extreme hill biome and I can start looking for emeralds this quickly? That would be nice. I went ahead and uninstalled the Thomcraft one just because it kind of became the bane of why several things were not being not oh, it is an extreme hills so i've got an extreme hills and a plains here that means horses will be easy to find animals will be easy to spawn out um yeah all that good stuff all right that makes me really happy i've got an above ground lava pool even so sweet all right it definitely looks like i will have a lot better a lot easier of a time on this one and one other thing that I'm gonna wow I just fell in a hole that was awesome one other thing fall let me get out over here okay I need to eat which I've got apples to start with that's awesome Nom, 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 nom. All right, and don't fall in the hole again. Give me the chicken. Come here, chicken. I've also installed the morph mod, which is kind of fun. It allows me to switch in and out between things, like here, boom, I'm a chicken. One of the things they did was they scaled the health down, so I actually have the health of a chicken and 
the appearance of a chicken, which means I don't take fall damage at the moment. Um, to get to the... Wow, that grass is trippy! Um, I forget where I was going with this. Oh yeah, fall damage. As a chicken, chickens flap their wings, and they don't take fall damage. They also fall a lot slower, so... Kind of cool. Um, if I want to fly, I got to get into the nether. That kind of a thing. Okay, switching back. It's these. Switching back to me. Crunch, crunch as we hear my bones snap and break and pop back into place. I'm a human! Turn that off. Yeah, I've been able to play entire games with that up there. And s when I watch other people playing and the coordinates are always displayed, it annoys the crap out of me. But I've been able to do it when I'm playing, and I can just look up and, okay, there I am, that's what's going I've even got a swamp biome over there! Yay, that means easy access to slimes! <sighs> Thank you, green god in the lookout. Getting wood! All right, and now we start into this horrible design of horribleness. I'm not in hardcore mode. I'm not that awesome just yet. As you kind of saw last time, combat eludes me. Besides, when we get into the nether, that's just pretty much straight death, and my game would end there. And that's no fun. I want to kind of explore, see what's going on. I've not been to the Twilight Forest. I've seen some videos on the Twilight Forest, which is really fun. It looks fun, at least. So I'm going to try... I'm, I'm going to try to stay within this area... At least in the beginning, I might branch out and explore, but I want to get some of those emerald tools. And I think there's even like an emerald portal I can build. Just using the emerald, like the actual emerald blocks. Build them up, strike it up just like a actual uh, nether portal. Back at you. So I'm going to try to get down here as low as I can. Uh, what was the first... Okay, yeah, I need to do this. Oop, hop, heep, boop. And get me my crafting table. Boop, bop, beep. There we go. Make as many annoying sounds as possible. That is the best way to get people to watch your stuff. Beep, blop, bloop, bloop, bleep, 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 bloop. Alright. Oh my goodness. Hey, there's a bat. If I can kill the bat, I can get a morph for flying, then I just gotta get into the nether. All good things, all good stuffs. I don't know if anybody can see while I'm in the dark, so I may have to boost the gamma levels there. What are you? Oh, you're applied. You're the citrus ore. Which, you know, before I get too far into mining and all that goodness here, exploring these caves, I probably should, you know, make a pickaxe, make a furnace... Make a couple of torches, all of that nonsense. So, I'm just going to install this here. Bloop. Clunk this. Pickaxe. Okay, yep. Kind of have to do this first. Boom. Take my birch wood. Take the oak planks. Oops, that's not right. Those go there. This goes here. Boop, 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 boop. I swear I've played this game before. There we go. Pickaxe. Time to mine! Take you. One, two, three. Brr. Oh, come on. Brr. Oh, come on. Get in there. Boop, boop. What is going on? Bloop, bloop. There we go. Beep. Alright. Upgrade! Now I can easily break stone and harvest iron ore. Which is what I need in order to get the rest of the stuff. Alright, grab that. Uh, no, I need to make a furnace. I need nine more. As we all know, this is how every Minecraft game starts. I need ore, I need coal, I need stone. Everything around me is dying, everything is horrible. I'm just starting out new, I don't want to die! Yeah, that's how every game starts. Guarantee it. Every Minecraft player starts exactly the same way. 
There's even the oh, oh, no. Don't lie to me. You all know you've done it. Okay, I've got enough there. Now, they're not as all derpy as I am with the fact that they can't hit a stone block. Okay, do 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 and furnace and coal. And what did I need in the coal? Okay, torch here so I can see kind of what's going on and you guys can see what's going on. Look, it's my base! <laughs> And there's my first Zed. I can hear it. Now apparently the Morph Mod does not fool other mobs around us. So if a mob comes out and says, Oh, you look tasty. They're, they're still going to respond the exact same way of, Oh, you look tasty. And come on, I need these to make some more torches. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Okay. Clunk this here. I'll put two of those in. Grab this. Put two of those on. Make me my torches. Yeah! Uh, should probably go make an axe if I was thinking. Get some more wood. Alright. For my first starting out base, I don't think this is too bad. Alright, coal, that, 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 this, though, those, that, these, here. Boom, 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 boom. Ba da ba ba ba. As I get trademarked. Two of those, and a stick, and. It's coming. I know it's coming. I can hear it. I better get this over here. Hi, zombie! Bye, zombie! Yeah! Just in time. Alright, I'm gonna head out here. Murder me a sheep. I'm sorry, sheep, but I need your wool. I need yours, too. Okay, and yours as well, sheepy. I'm sorry, sheeples. Alright, now I can... What's real fun is because of that, I can now be a zombie. Oh, great creepers. No, 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 no! Okay. Yep, I'm dumb. No! Whatever. Alright, switching back out of zombie status. I think zombies can actually heal. Right, whoop. There we go. Alright. Zombie chicken. Alright, do I got enough wood? I've got just enough wood that I can create me a spawn point so I don't have to worry about death. Doo -doo -doo. There's a skeleton above me too. And clunk that there. Alright. Monsters aren't nearby. I thought there were monsters nearby. So with that, was there a skeleton around here? Or I know there's another creeper over here somewhere. Uh, there's a skeleton. Yep, that one's a skeleton up there. Uh, don't eat the rotten flesh, but that may be what I'm resorting to. Just because... Wait a second, I thought there was a skeleton up here. Was he on fire? Or did I just see a really well-armored sheep? Nope, okay. Alright, there's a creeper. Let's see if I can acquire a creeper morph. Come on, creeper. Come to me. That's right, now you see me, don't ya? Alright, and forward, and back, 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 and smack, and back, 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 and back
Alright, so from here I've got a couple of paths I could take, going down or going the other down. But all in all, my paths are going to take me down because that's where all the goodies are. Alright, so stash, stash, stash. This will actually go into slot one. Uh, the bread will come with me, and I might as well take the apples as well. Okay, switch you to slot one so I can attack with you easier. Did I grab the torches? I did not grab the torches. Yay! Looks like everything's starting out so good. Because I'm awesome and stuff. Alright, grab me some coals. Bup, 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 bup. And I know there was iron over there. I did see that. So, torch here. Boop. So I can explore better. Because I don't have any potions of night vision yet. Boop. There we go. Hi, Skelly. You want to come up here and see me? Or do I got to come down there to you? I really don't want to come down there to you, though. Because you, sir, are a jerk face. Ooh, charged citrus. Yay. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have to go down there to him if I want his bones or his morph. Which it would be fun to acquire, like, an entire catalog of morphs. I wonder if I could use the creeper to my advantage. Okay, he is trying to shoot me now. Well, that cave just opens up into epic. Okay, and there's iron right there when I want that. Uh, still using the what am I looking at mob or mod, so I can see around there. Yeah, he shot straight up into that rock, didn't he? Yeah, that just opens up into all kinds of awesome. Okay. Not too worried about taking damage. Or not, I'm sorry, not taking damage. Not too worried about him shooting me, I should say. Alright, and with these up, I shouldn't have anything that spawns in on top of my pseudo base. But I also think I am rapidly running out of time before really getting much anything done. Ooh, hey, ooh, hey! You just blew all this all kinds of open for me, didn't you? Thank you, creepers ish. Use, use this creepers for explosive mining. Come on, just die already. There we go. Whoa, hi there. Whoa, hi there. Still don't have any armor on yet. Okay, can't hit the skeleton. Can't hit the skeleton. There we go. <sighs> Munch on an apple. Really should save those, though. It's not that apples are exactly rare. It's just apples are really nice for making their upgrades of goldens, which are much, much, much more useful. All right, so there's four chunklets of iron. I hear you, skeleton. No, 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 no! Yes! Woo! Running back to base camp. I almost died there. Thank you, Regen. Hi, sheep. Unfortunately, it's not 1.8, so you don't give me mutton, so you're not good for anything but wool. But thanks, sheep. I'm going to assume that was a you're welcome. Alright. Making sure that mobs don't spawn around the entrance to my, quote, base. Little hole in the wall set up. I probably will build me a nice little house eventually. But at the moment, just like Every other is beginning to every other Minecraft video. Just let me survive. Alright, I've only got four ore, so it's a gross misuse of my iron, or my coal. Uh, I forget if this will work here or... Whoa! Silverfish, really? I can acquire silverfish this early? Come here. I want to get you.
These things are nasty, too. Why am I using the pickaxe? Let me use the sword. They can infest. They're kind of like termites. They infest your stuff and then just break it, getting out. And apparently, I managed to find. Oh, good night! Yep. I managed to find me a nice little nest of them. Great for experience, though. Stupid little. Minecraft termites. That is a skeleton. Really don't feel like fighting it at the moment. But does that drop... Okay, a stone will drop the citrus. Which I need for making something else later on. But not going to get into that right now. So, as I've said three times now... Curses you. Woo! Acquired hardware. Let me at least get my iron pick. Thanks for joining me on the beginning of this, what could be a very promising or very horrible run of Minecraft Modded Survival, and I will catch you guys next time. Puts all stuff away. So I don't murder myself and die. You go here, you go here. Bye!